When it comes to vaccines, our focus is often on their benefits in preventing diseases and strengthening our immune systems. However, it is equally important to understand the potential side effects that they may cause. In this video, we delve into the lesser-known aspects of Ginios, a vaccine designed to protect against smallpox and monkeypox. By exploring the potential side effects of Ginios, we aim to provide you with a comprehensive understanding of this vaccine's safety profile. Understanding the importance of vaccine side effects. Vaccines play a crucial role in preventing the spread of infectious diseases and safeguarding public health. They work by stimulating our immune system to recognize and fight off specific pathogens. While vaccines are generally safe and well-tolerated, they can occasionally cause side effects. It is important to remember that the benefits of vaccines far outweigh the risks, as they have successfully prevented countless illnesses and saved numerous lives. When it comes to assessing the safety of a vaccine, it is crucial to consider the balance between the potential side effects and the benefits it provides. Vaccines undergo rigorous testing and evaluation before they are approved for use. This includes clinical trials involving thousands of participants, monitoring for safety, and assessing the efficacy of the vaccine. However, it is still important to be aware of the potential side effects associated with any vaccine, including Ginios. Common Side Effects of Ginios Ginios is a combination vaccine that provides protection against both smallpox and monkeypox. It is administered as a series of two doses, given four weeks apart. Like any vaccine, Ginios may cause some side effects, although they are generally mild and temporary. The most commonly reported side effects of Ginios include injection site reactions, fever, and fatigue. Injection site reactions are the most frequently observed side effect of Ginios. These reactions are typically characterized by redness, swelling, and tenderness at the injection site. They may occur within a few hours of receiving the vaccine and can last for a few days. In most cases, these reactions resolve on their own without any specific treatment. Fever is another common side effect reported by individuals who have received Ginios. It is important to note that fever is a natural response of the immune system and indicates that the body is mounting an appropriate immune response to the vaccine. Fever is generally mild and self-limiting, but if it persists or becomes severe, it is advisable to seek medical attention. Fatigue, or a feeling of tiredness, is also a commonly reported side effect of Ginios. This can occur after receiving the vaccine and may last for a few days. It is important to rest and take care of oneself during this period. Fatigue can be managed by getting plenty of rest, staying hydrated, and avoiding strenuous physical activity. Rare but serious side effects of Ginios. While rare, serious side effects can occur with any vaccine, including Ginios. It is important to note that the occurrence of serious side effects is extremely rare, and the benefits of vaccination far outweigh the risks. Serious side effects that have been reported with Ginios include severe allergic reactions, myocarditis, and pericarditis. Severe allergic reactions, although rare, can occur after receiving Ginios. These reactions typically manifest as difficulty breathing, swelling of the face or throat, hives, and dizziness. If you experience any of these symptoms after receiving the vaccine, it is important to seek immediate medical attention. Myocarditis and pericarditis are rare side effects that have been reported in individuals who have received Ginios. Myocarditis refers to inflammation of the heart muscle, while pericarditis refers to inflammation of the lining around the heart. Symptoms may include chest pain, shortness of breath, and an abnormal heartbeat. If you experience any of these symptoms after receiving Ginios, it is important to seek medical attention promptly. Managing and Treating Ginios Side Effects most side effects of Ginios are mild and self-limiting, requiring little to no specific treatment. However, there are steps you can take to manage and alleviate any discomfort you may experience. For injection site reactions, applying a cold compress to the affected area and taking over-the-counter pain relievers, such as acetaminophen or ibuprofen, can help reduce swelling and relieve pain. In the case of fever, it is important to stay hydrated and rest. You can also take over-the-counter fever reducers, such as acetaminophen or ibuprofen, to help reduce fever and alleviate any associated discomfort. However, it is important to follow the dosage instructions and consult with a healthcare professional if you have any concerns. Fatigue can be managed by getting plenty of rest and maintaining a healthy lifestyle. It is important to listen to your body and give it the time it needs to recover. Engaging in light physical activity, such as gentle stretching or walking, can also help alleviate fatigue. If your fatigue persists or worsens, it is advisable to consult with a healthcare professional. Reporting and Monitoring Ginios Side Effects 
The safety of vaccines, including Ginios, is continuously monitored by healthcare professionals and regulatory authorities. It is important to report any side effects you experience after receiving the vaccine to your healthcare provider. This information is crucial in ensuring the ongoing safety and effectiveness of vaccines. In the United States, the Vaccine Adverse Event Reporting System VAERS, is a national system for monitoring the safety of vaccines. It allows healthcare professionals and individuals to report any adverse events following vaccination. This information is then carefully analyzed to identify any potential safety concerns. The importance of informed consent and patient education. Informed consent is a vital component of healthcare decision making. Before receiving any vaccine, including Ginios, it is important to have a thorough understanding of its potential benefits and risks. This includes being aware of the potential side effects and any precautions or contraindications. Healthcare professionals play a crucial role in providing accurate and up-to-date information about vaccines to patients. They can answer any questions or concerns you may have and help you make an informed decision about vaccination. Patient education materials, such as brochures or websites, are also valuable resources for learning more about vaccines and their potential side effects. Frequently asked questions about Ginio's side effects. Are the side effects of Ginio's more common after the first or second dose? Side effects can occur after either the first or second dose of Ginio's. However, it is important to note that some individuals may experience more pronounced side effects after the second dose. How long do the side effects of Ginio's typically last? Most side effects of Ginio's, such as injection site reactions, fever, and fatigue, are temporary and resolve within a few days. However, individual experiences may vary. Can Ginio's cause long-term side effects? Long-term side effects from Ginio's are extremely rare. The safety of vaccines is continuously monitored, and any potential risks are thoroughly evaluated. Conclusion and Final Thoughts In conclusion, understanding the potential side effects of vaccines is crucial for making informed decisions about our health. Ginios, a vaccine designed to protect against smallpox and monkeypox, can cause some side effects, although they are generally mild and temporary. Common side effects include injection site reactions, fever, and fatigue. Serious side effects are rare but can include severe allergic reactions, myocarditis, and pericarditis. It is important to report any side effects to healthcare professionals and to seek medical attention if necessary. By being informed and educated, we can confidently navigate the world of vaccines and prioritize our health and well-being. Thanks for watching.